So now we're going to show you how to set it up for an overhead wire pull, which will be an identical situation. This is how we started for an underground wire pull. Now we're going to set it up for an overhead wire pull. Dude, let's put my pin in. Take my clip. Stand this up. I'm going to take this into my conduit. Insert that on my connector and I'm ready to make my pull. Now, there's two key elements in this pull right here. Number one is my capstan is pointed down. To date, we've really not shown you any pictures where your capstan's pointed down for an overhead wire pull. The reason I want it pointed down is I want to take my rope and my wire from my conduit, make sure it touches this roller, and goes back to my capstan. Everything is on the down side of this puller. So when I'm done, all I have to do is drop that half an inch and pull this out. A key element in doing this, when you're setting up your angles, you want to make sure the rope at least touches your roller before you engage in a wire pull. When the rope touches the roller, I am dead parallel to this bar and nothing will bend. Okay? That's how you set it up for an overhead pull.